Hello friends, welcome to JavaScript video tutorial series. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss JavaScript plus operator. JavaScript provides plenty of operators for performing various operations. It provides arithmetic operators, logical operators, relational operators, conditional operator, bitwise operators, many more. We discuss all of the operators in detail in upcoming video tutorials. In this video tutorial, especially we concentrate on JavaScript plus operator. Before we proceed and understand JavaScript plus operator, first we understand what is an expression. A valid combination of operators and operands is known as expression. Here I have some of the examples for expressions. 2 plus 2, it's a valid expression because it gives us a result 4. 2 plus 2 plus 2, it's a valid expression. When we evaluate this expression, we get the result 6. 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2, it's a valid expression. When we evaluate this expression, we get the result 8. Whereas, this expression is not a valid expression. Here I have minus plus 2, 2, 2. There is no proper combination of operators and operands. When we try to evaluate, we don't get any result. Actually, it's an invalid expression, friends. So, hope you guys have understood what is an expression especially. Okay, it's a valid combination of operators and operands which should give us a result when we evaluate that expression. An expression contains two elements. They are operators and operands. Here we have plus is an operator. This 2 and 2 are operands for this plus operator. In this expression, we have two plus operators and three operands. Here we have four operands. Two, 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 two are operands. Plus, plus, plus are operators. Operator is going to perform an operation on the given operands. What happens here when we evaluate this expression or how the computer evaluates this expression? It takes this two and two, adds both of them and gives a result four. Next, you can see in the second expression, we have two plus operators. When there are more than one plus operators in an expression, computer evaluates that expression from left to right. So first it adds these two, two plus two, four. Then it adds four plus two, gives a result six. Here again, we have three plus operators. So the expression should be evaluated from left to right or computer evaluates that expression from left to right. 2 plus 2, it gives 4. 4 plus 2, it gives 6. 6 plus 2, it gives 8. The final result it shows us is 8. That is the meaning of expression and how the expressions are going to be evaluated, friends. I talk about expressions and operators in detail in the later videos also. Here, I hope you guys have got an idea of what is an expression, what is an operator, if we have more than one plus operators, how the expression is going to be evaluated. Let's proceed and understand JavaScript plus operator. JavaScript plus operator is an overloaded operator. That means it acts differently in different situations. JavaScript plus operator accepts two operands. If one of the given operand is of string type, then the plus operator acts as a concatenation operator. If both operands are of number type, then the plus operator acts as an addition operator. So, the plus operator acts differently in different situations. Sometimes it acts as a concatenation operator. Sometimes it acts as an addition operator. Here I have a table so that you can be able to understand how the plus operator works. Let me explain. If we have left hand side operand of type string, and the right hand side operand of type string, then the plus operator works as a concatenation operator. Concatenation means appending friends. Okay. It works as a concatenation operator, gives a result of type string. If left hand side operand is of string type and the right hand side operand of number type, then the plus operator works as a concatenation operator, gives a result of type string. If left hand side operand is of number type and the right hand side operand is of string type, then the plus operator works as a concatenation operator, gives a result of type string. 
if left hand side operand is of number type and the right hand side operand is of number type then the plus operator works as a addition operator gives a result of type number you can see here left hand side we have number type right hand side we have number type so plus operator works as a addition operator gives a result 4 which is of type number some of the examples i have here below here i have a plus operator left hand side we have a string right hand side we have a string so here the plus operator works as a concatenation operator it appends this two to this two and gives a result two two a string two two here left hand side we have a string right hand side we have a number so plus operator works as a concatenation operator it gives a result double quotation two two double quotation that's actually a string left hand side we have a number right hand side we have a string so the plus operator work as a concatenation operator it appends this 2 to this 2 and gives a result 2 2 here we have left hand side a number here we have right hand side a number so the plus operator work as addition operator it gives a result sum that is 4 which is of type number friends let's see the demonstration and get some idea I minimize MS Word, I go to start, say here notepad, I click on the notepad, then I write here basic HTML document structure code, you can see I have pasted the basic HTML document structure code, I save file, save as, I save the file at desktop with the name default.html, both sides I put double quotations, click on the save button. I minimize the notepad, you can see that default.html is created at the desktop, I right click on it, say open with the Firefox. You can see that default.html open in the Firefox, I am going to set the title now, I go to notepad, maximize it, in the head section I say title, javascript plus operator demo, closing title tag, file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that title is set to javascript plus operator demo. Then in the body section I embed the javascript code. Here I say script type equal to text or javascript. Then I say here closing script tag. Within that I say document dot write. In double quotations I say hello world. File save go to browser and refresh. You can see that hello world got displayed. That's good. Next what I do, I give here 2. I am giving a string to file, save, go to browser and refresh. We got the result 2. Next I tell to the browser, add another string to bracket close. This time you can see left hand side we have a string, right hand side we have a string. So the plus operator is going to work as a concatenation operator. It appends this 2 to 2 and gives a final result is going to be a string to 2. Okay. So I say here 2 plus 2. Let's see the output. Here I should get the output to 2. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see I am getting to 2. Browser is going to evaluate this expression friends. It is going to evaluate this expression. The final result is going to be like this. It is going to be a string to 2 file save go to browser and refresh i'm getting the same output right understand this next i add a break here so i say document dot write in double quotations i say break tag then i copy that code paste down this time i give two this is a number two or i give a string two file save go to browser and refresh I get the output 2 here below ok next I say plus 2 left hand side we have a string 2 right hand side we have a number 2 this expression is going to be evaluated as we know that plus operator work as a concatenation operator it concatenates these two together it says 2 2 string it is going to be the final result of that expression is double quotation 2 2 double quotation so the output we get is 2 2 let's see that first i remove this i say plus 2 file save go to browser and refresh i'm getting the output 2 2 so plus is working as a concatenation operator 
Next, I copy this line, paste down, then I paste one more time. This time I give a number to file, save, go to browser and refresh. I got here 2. Next, I say plus double quotations 2. Left hand side we have a number, right hand side we have a string. So the plus operator work as a concatenation operator. It appends this 2 to this 2. Final result is going to be 2 2. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see we are getting 2 2. Next what I do? I copy this, paste down. I paste one more time. This time I give a number 2. File, save, go to browser and refresh. I got 2 here. Next I say plus 2. Left hand side we have a number. Right hand side we have a number. So the plus operator work as an addition operator. It gives a result 4 on the screen. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see I am getting here 4 not the concatenation. So plus operator works differently in different situations friends. It's an overloaded operator. Let me give some more examples so that you get a clear idea. I am going to copy this, paste down, I paste one more time and then I say here 2 plus 2 plus 2. Can you tell me the output for this? Simple. If we have more than one plus operator in an expression, we know that the computer evaluates that expression from left to right. 2 plus 2 it evaluates to 4, 4 plus 2 it evaluates to 6, right? So the final output I am going to get is 6. Let me write here 2 plus 2 plus 2. File, save, go to browser and refresh. I got the result 6. Similarly, I am going to copy this, paste one more time here and I paste one more time. I say here 2 plus 2 plus plus 4 let's take. How the computer evaluates this expression? As we have more than one plus operators, it evaluates the expression from left to right. First it evaluates these two, 2 plus 2, left hand side a number, right hand side a number. So 2 plus 2 is going to become 4, plus works as a addition operator, we get here 4. Next the computer evaluates 4 plus 2 left hand side a number, right hand side a number, it works as a plus operator that is a addition operator, 4 plus 2 it gives 6. Then it evaluates this expression 6 plus 4, left hand side a number, right hand side a number, so plus works as a addition operator, 6 plus 4 is going to be 10, the final result we get here is 10. Let's see the demonstration 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus File, save, go to browser and refresh. I got the result 10. Next, I say here paste. One more time I paste. This time I write string 2 plus string 2 plus string 2. What will be the output for this friends? Do we get 2, 2, 2 or we get 2, 2, 4? What, what we get actually? As we have more than 1 plus operators in the expression, Computer evaluate that expression from left to right. This is how it evaluates. Left hand side is string, right hand side is string. So the plus operator works as a concatenation operator. It concatenates this 2 and this 2. The final result is going to be 2, 2. So we get a string 2, 2. Again it evaluates this and this. So left hand side we have a string, right hand side we have a string. It concatenates both of them. The final result we get is 2, 2, 2, a string 2, 2, 2. The output we are going to get is 2, 2, 2 here. Let's see the demonstration again. So 2 plus string 2 plus string 2. File, save, go to browser and refresh. I get the output 2, 2, 2. Hope you guys are understanding it's simple. Let me copy that, paste down. This time I write mixed mode expression. I say here 2. Then I give a number 2, then I give a string 2. You can see here, we have a number in the middle, right? So how this expression is going to be evaluated? As we have more than 1 plus operators, computer evaluates the expression from left to right. Remember that. Here what happens? First, it evaluates the first plus operator. 
so left hand side we have a string right hand side a number as we have left hand side a string right hand side a number plus operator works as a concatenation operator it concatenates these two together so we get here a final output is going to be a string to 2 okay then it evaluates these two so here what happens left hand side a string right hand side a string plus works as a concatenation operator it concatenates all these together we get the final output 2 2 2 as a output friend so we get here 2 2 2 let me write that so string and a number and a string string number string file save go to browser and refresh we get the result 2 2 2 i think i have not put a break i copy this paste down file save go to browser and refresh okay let's see one more example here i say control v i paste one more time this time i write differently i write 2 plus 2 plus a string 2 what output we get for this friends let's evaluate the expression as we know that more than one plus operators we have so computer evaluate the expression from left to right first it evaluates 2 plus 2 left hand side a number right hand side a number so result we are going to get is 4 because plus works as a addition operator 4 then left hand side a number right hand side is string when we have a number and a string we know that plus works as a concatenation operator so it appends 4 and 2 we get the final result 4 2 okay so i should get the result 4 2 here let's see that 2 plus 2 plus a string 2 file save go to browser and refresh you can see that we are getting the result 4 2 I hope you guys have clearly understood how the plus operator works in different situations. I suggest you people to experiment more. In the next video tutorial, we get more information. For this tutorial, this much is enough, friends. For more benefits and be up to date, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to like, comment, and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.